Hey folks, welcome back. It's me Narendar. Today we are going to discuss about Python variable names. Before getting into the topic, I'll give you simple example to understand this topic in a better manner. So when we are kids, uh, we used to go to school, right? You went, I also went to school. Most of us went to school, right? So there are some rules and regulations which are given by school authority. So we need to follow them, right? For example, we need to wear uniform, shoes and tie, belt and ID card. So these are the rules which we need to follow, right? These are the compulsory rules, right? Here also in Python, we have some rules and regulations that we must follow to create Python variables. So we are going to discuss about those rules. So let's begin. A Python variable can have a short name like X and Y or a more descriptive name like age, car name, total underscore value. Rules for Python variables. A variable name must start with a letter or the underscore character. A variable name cannot start with a number. So you need to remember this line. A variable name cannot start with number. Okay. A variable name can only contain alpha numeric characters and underscore. So only these three, three things it can have. So then variable names are case sensitive. That means age. Here you can see this age is different from this age and this age is also different from this age. So these three are different variables. So these are the examples you can see. So if I run them also, I won't get any error. So here you can see this is a in lower case this variable. So here we used underscore here also we used underscore. So here you can see this variable is different from the first variable. And here you can see here all letters are in uppercase. So here I used numeric value. So you can use numeric value, but at the end or in between like that. Okay. Here, these are the variables which we should not use. Okay. Uh, so you can see invalid syntax. So here you can see in this first one, we are starting with numeric value. So that's a illegal run, right? So we cannot use this kind of minus kind of symbol, right? So we cannot give space in between, right? Multi words, variable names, variable names with more than one word can be difficult to read. There are several techniques you can use to make them more readable. So first one is Campbell case. Each word except the first starts with a capital letter. Here you can see the first word is in lowercase and then after that this word starts with the capital letter and the here name is also starts with the capital letter. So this is the camel case. Next Pascal case each word starts with the capital letter as you can see. So each word starts with a capital letter here in this case and next one is snake case. Each word is separated by a underscore character. Here you can see. And that's it for now. Hope you like this video and meet you in the next video. Till then, bye bye.